Hi there, this is Holly from Let's Plan, making a video to show you how you would download digital products from my shop. What you're seeing on the screen here is just a PDF from my dated digital planners. I'm going to show you this example because there is an extra step, but this would go for any planner landscape orientation or portrait, any of my other planners, you will get an option with a PDF that just says click here to download. This one, because it's the dated planner, you get a few more options, which I wanted to go over because sometimes it throws people. These options are going to be for the planner you choose. With the um, all-in-one planner, you get the option of four different color tabs, which is what's indicated here. You get blush, purple, or on the second page, teal and gray. You get the option of a Sunday start, which would mean the start of the week in your planner, Sunday or Monday. You get the option of a horizontal week layout, which is here. I don't know if you can see that, it's pretty small, or the vertical week layout. And in my Etsy listings, you can see the difference if you're not sure. Um, what this means is when you click on the link next to that particular planner, that's the planner that you will download. You will have the options to come back and change what planner you want if you decide that is not for you. So let me go ahead and click on one. I'm going to be clicking on the blush Sunday start vertical week, which is going to only change the vertical weekly layout, not the entire planner, just the weekly layout page. So I'm going to click on that. It's going to take me over to Dropbox. Now in Dropbox, you may get pop-up windows making it sound like you need to get the app, install Dropbox. Um, what is this? We're not going to try that now. You'll get different pop-up windows. You do not need to sign up for Dropbox. You do not need to get the app for Dropbox. Um, just close any pop-up windows. Your goal is to get to Dropbox.com. Our main goal is that we're going to be downloading the file that you are um, trying to put onto your device on to or into the files on your device. I'm using an iPad. It doesn't matter if you're using an iPad, an Android, any device will work. So when you get to Dropbox, after clicking the link, it's going to take you directly to Dropbox. From here, your only goal is to download this file onto your device. Don't open it. Don't try to use it. Don't do anything else to it. The only thing that does is mess up people and then they get half a file. So find your download button. Now, recently, Dropbox has changed their um, layout, and I don't know if it's the particular browser I'm in, I'm in Safari, but I've had customers messaging me, they can't find the download arrow anymore, which I agree, it used to be like right here. If you're in the portrait uh, orientation, rotate your device when you're in Dropbox, and it's going to change the layout here. Now way over here, they put the download arrow. Wish they would have never done that, they didn't think about that, but anyway. So what we're going to do is click on download, it's going to download this file onto our device. This pop-up window we do wanna see. This is going to confirm that we're downloading this file. We're just gonna go ahead. On the iPad, you can see it's downloading. It only takes a second. It's all gonna depend on the magic of the internet at your house, but it's done. It's on our iPad. If I wanna double check, I can hit that arrow and I can see the file there. I just did this a minute ago, so you'll see two of them, but that is it. Now I would go to my um, home screen find the app that will be hosting my planner and import it that way. I have a video about importing into the note-taking apps. If you need to watch that, go back to the PDF you received with your purchase. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to message me on Etsy.